I received my admission letter from Harvard on the 3rd of March, 2022. And the family was very excited. We were all excited that I was going to move outside of Ghana for the first time to study and the first person in my family to pursue a PhD program. After six days of receiving my admissions letter, I unfortunately lost my dad and had to leave Ghana um, in July to come here to start my program. When I got here, it was very challenging in my first year. I faced a lot of challenges thinking about my younger siblings in Ghana. How do I support them? How do I focus on my studies over here and all that? But then my program was also very helpful. I spoke to my program about the challenges that I was going through and they provided me with the needed resources and that really helped me to transition very well in the university community and then in Boston in general. When I moved to Boston, I had not heard about um, Shadak International House. And it's been nice meeting all these group of people, interacting with them, learning from their culture and all that. And my wife is also here who has been my backbone, supporting me when things are hard and then encouraging me that things will work out because PhD is not easy. Having a family as a graduate student uh, is very tough. Uh, it's something that uh, is very difficult, yeah. But then I think it's also fulfilling I was always interested in drug discovery. In Ghana, malaria is endemic. And growing up, I had a lot of episodes of malaria. And I remember whenever I had malaria, my dad would go for neem tree, which is a common tree in Ghana, cook it, and then let me drink it. It was very bitter. And after some days, I would feel better. And so I kept wondering, what is in this neem tree that is curing malaria? That drew me to drug discovery in general. And so I decided to look for programs that offer um, opportunities to research on the malaria parasite. And I saw that the Harvard Chan School has a lot of researchers who were working on malaria. And so that was a great opportunity and I decided to apply and I was accepted into the program. So that is the reason why I'm here today, studying malaria in the Durasen lab. I keep going because I have a dream of making sure that I change the narrative in my family, the financial status of my family. My dad, I remember these words very much, told me that, Frank, you are going to go far in life. I know that. But no matter where you get to, never forget your God and where you come from. <laughs>